Hey everyone, this is Megan with Primary Singing and today I'm going to show you this finger lights pattern for the song Shine On. This activity is a really great one to get everyone engaged. It's also a fun way to kind of do a little object lesson spiritual tie-in with shining our lights. So for this activity, we are going to be using simple, really simple shapes for each kind of part of the song. So this is what the printable looks like. You can find this printable in the full post that I'm going to link below. You can grab um, more details for the activity, extension ideas, and then this two page printable, one for the verse and one for the chorus. So we're just going to jump in and I'm going to show you what the actions are and then I'm going to run through it all together and you can try it out with me. This pattern was designed specifically for the first verse and chorus, but you can also kind of make it work for the second verse as well. All right, let's get started. So at the beginning, we have my light is but a little one. So for that one, we're gonna kind of wiggle our light. My light is but a little one. My light of faith and prayer. For this one, we're gonna do a big heart. But lo, it shines like God's great sun. We'll do a sun or even just a big circle. For it was lighted there. So this one, we're gonna go straight up. For it was lighted there. Then for the chorus, we're gonna kind of have this cool flashing effect so you can cover your light and then uncover it really fast so shine on shine on and then when we do bright and clear we'll do above our heads and then again as you do each shine on shine on shine on now the day is here we're going to do a spin so it's really simple uh, let's try it together with the music and i hope you have some fun with this activity all right my light is but a little one, my light of faith and prayer. But lo, it shines like God's great sun, for it was lighted there. Shine on, shine on, shine on bright and clear. Shine on, shine on. that's it. Um, let me know how you used this activity. I would love to hear from you. Um, again, be sure to grab that full post to find the printable and then also to find more ways to use this activity in your primary room. And we'll see you later.